Good afternoon. Peter Jata Gibbing Sam Nanini. Well, I, the crown of peace of Senegal, I stand by my population of Nigeria. My Christian brother and sisters. My Christian brother and sisters, my mothers, my fathers, and Nigeria, we all stand together. We all end this together. It's not time to say I am not a Nigerian. We all African. When our African people are crying, we all Africans stand together as one and fight against it. I'm calling the President of the United States, Mr. Donald Trump, to stand by I, the Crown of Peace of the Senegambia, to fight for my Christian brother and sister to have the freedom to live their life free like any other person, Christian life matters, Nigeria for all. Mr. President Donald Trump, President Buhari of the Nigeria, shouldn't be even allowed, accepted to enter in, in the United States. When a president leading a country and against a religion and using his power, terrorize other religion, especially the Christian, I don't think that president will love any Christian living around the world. Mr. President Donald Trump, America is a country, all the president of the United States was Christian and we never see such a things, such an act existing in the United States. And in the United States, carry all the religion. We calling your help. I, the crown of peace of Senegambia, I, the crown of peace of Senegambia, again, Mr. Donald Trump, I'm calling your help to stand by me, to burn President Buhari and his whole entire family. Do not enter in America. As long as our Christian brother and sisters are living hell in Nigeria, Buhari shouldn't live free in any other country. Those innocent children, who not even born yet, shouldn't be tortured, killed. They don't ask to be here. God bought them. Any life matter. The killing in Nigeria of the Christian is too much. It must stop. I'm asking the United States to stand up and help us to fight this to make it end of it. President Buhari, if you don't like a Christian, I don't think he have respect even all the Christian living even in the United States. You cannot help the couch and you want to eat the tail. Today, uh, the Christian life in Nigeria, Nigeria is the worst place to be a Christian today. For us to be free, I'm demanding the independence and the freedom of Biafra. Those Christian life, Christian family, they have to live free. Biafra demanding separation and independence, I think it's time for Biafra to stand there on their own. And I'm calling everyone to stand up by Biafra. Biafra must be free for the Christian brother and sister to have home. Right now, too much offering in Nigeria, too much Christian offering, not Muslim. You never heard a Christian community went to a Muslim community killing them. Today, the Christian family cannot live on their own village in Nigeria. The Christian people, they cannot go to their own church in Nigeria. Christian people have no life to raise their voice. Buari be killing them day and night. It is time for all of us to stand up for the freedom of Biafra. For my Christian family to have home. Mr. President Donald Trump, we're calling you, we're whispering your name. The baby is being killed, the Christian baby being killed, they're calling your name. We need help. Nigeria need help right now. The Christians are living hell. Why should be banned any other access of a Christian country? The Muslims are living free in Nigeria because the president is using his power. If the Muslims are living free, the Christian must live free too. Again, we're demanding, 
I, the Crown of Peace of Senegambi, am demanding the freedom of Biafra. Everyone to stand for that. It is time Biafra be free to save Nigeria. For the Christian brother and sisters, mother and father to have home. Nigeria is you enough to be a true country. Mr. President Donald Trump, the president of the continent of Africa, they're not smart enough to roll even 10 CD. They cannot handle that. Nigeria is more than 20 CD. It's too big to be handled in one stupid president. What cannot handle Nigeria? Nigeria deserves to have two presidents to save life, to save people life, to save the Christian sisters, mothers, fathers, especially the baby, those who not even be born, they've been killed, tortured, terribly. I can't sleep when I watch those images. I cannot even share it. It's heartbroken. I cannot even, I can't imagine how heartless are those bloody people killing Christian babies who, who's innocent. They don't even know what the name of killing. They don't even know the word, how it started. How can you be, how can you be heartless and carrying a shadow, knife, cutting them like nothing? It is too much. Mr. President Donald Trump, we am demanding and I'm calling your name. Ban President Buhari and his, his whole entire family and stand up for the freedom of Biafra to save our people. The Christian brother and sisters must live free. All hell Biafra. We all want, there's nothing sweeter than home. Is enough refugee, is enough back way. America cannot carry everyone. People are so proud to be their home. But, but if home is dangerous for them, where should they go? Where are they going to run? Through so many orphans, Christian orphans. They cannot even be free to live on their own village now anymore. They cannot even go to farm. They cannot even go to church. They even afraid to be claimed now they Christian. I don't think it's fair for people to live in prison on their own home when they don't do nothing. I call the whole world to stand up as one. Free Biafra to save our own people in Nigeria. Christian life matter. Christian life matter. I against every torture of a religion. I am not religious. I just believe in God. I'm on my own. But I against religion war. I against religion fight. Free Biafra for Nigeria to be saved. Mr. President Donald Trump, I'm calling your name again. It's time to stand by I, the crown of peace of Senegambia. My voice being raised thousand times. Buari must be born to enter in America. If Buari don't respect the Christian in Nigeria, Buari have no respect for the Christian living in America. Such a president should be born. Christian life matter. Nigeria for all. I feel hurt and painful. I couldn't sleep one week. Those images I saw, pregnant women, Christian be cut and baby be killed, it's just too much. Mr. President Donald Trump, I'm calling your name again. We, the voice of the voiceless, especially I, the missionary of the continent of Africa, the crown of peace of Senegal, the green dragon, I'm calling your name to stand by I. Buari must be born. Biafra must have the freedom to save Christian life in the Nigeria. Nigeria for all. Free Biafra. Thank you.